hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to install kali linux on your android device now this is really easy as long as you follow these steps kali linux is designed for pen testing and ethical hacking so basically you can perform wonders with your smartphone now the requirement is you should have at least 8 gig of free storage on your device note you can only install on your internal storage and not an external sd card your phone should be at least 4 gig of ram so it doesn't lag and slow down your phone take it like this you're installing a brand new operating system on your smartphone so it's really heavy. Now I'm currently using a Redmi Note 8 Pro with 6GB of RAM and over 60GB of storage available on this device. Now follow these steps closely. First we have to download Temox over here and NetHunterKex. Now we can get Temox from GitHub. The link will be provided in the video description. Now some of you may ask why we are not downloading Temox from Google Play Store. You can see Temox on Google Play Store is very outdated. The last time it was updated is 2020 September and we are in 2022. Lots of these packages have changed and it won't work. So we have to download the latest version of Temox from GitHub. So you can see Temox over here, Temox app version 0.118 and it was updated January 07, 2022. So download it. I already have it downloaded in my device. And also download the NetHunter app store. So you can see over here, download store app. Now take note, the link to all these will be provided in the video description. Now after downloading, install your NetHunter store. And then from NetHunter store, this is where we are going to download NetHunter Kex. So you can just scroll down or you can just search as well. So let's just search for Kex, K-E-X. And you can see over here, NetHunter Kex over here, click on it. And then install, I already have it installed on my device. So you can see on my device, NetHunter Kex, Temox, and NetHunter Store. Now I can delete NetHunter Store since I no longer need it. Now let's open our Temox and then start the installation process. So open Temox. Now take note, the commands in this video are case sensitive, so make sure you type it exactly at scene. Now you could also copy from our Discord server and then paste it directly, so the choice is yours. Now let's begin. First, we have to update the references and to do that, type in the command pkg update and then hit enter okay so enter y and then hit enter to continue with the prompt now type y and hit enter y and hit enter again so you just have to proceed with yes hit enter until the whole process is completed okay so it has been successfully updated now we have to install wget and that is what we are going to use to install kali linux so type in the command install wget pkg install wget and then hit enter now pkg stands for the package so let's go with y yes and then hit enter okay so wget has been installed now let's type in this command to get the bash script which is going to call the kali linux file which we are going to use for this installation so type in this command exactly as seen. Two M C E Z W R O and then hit enter. Okay, now type in the next command. And then hit enter and then type in this command to download the Kali Linux ISO file and then hit enter now we have to wait for the installation to complete this may take some time so you can get a cup of coffee while waiting so you can see it has now been installed successfully if you got any prompt why it was downloading and installing you just have to continue with yes, agree to all of them and it would lead you to something like this. Now we have to set up the Kex password and that is what we are going to use to log in. So type in the command and then hit enter and then type in your password. So let me just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, verify password, hit enter. Would you like to enter a view only password? Let me just go with no so I can see the password okay so we have successfully set up the password now we can successfully access our kali linux machine 
Now to launch Kali, type in the command kex and kex and you can see the symbol over there. Hit enter. Now you can close the app and then open your net hunter kex over here and then enter the password over here. You can see the password over here. So let's enter the password which is one, two, three, four, five, six, and then hit connect over here. So you can see Kali Linux has been successfully installed. Now you can access all of the Kali Linux tools and you can do whatever you want to do here. Now if you want to stop this program from running, simply head back to Temox and then type in the command kex stop and then hit enter. So after doing that, it would successfully close your Kali Linux and you can see connection fade. So basically, this is how to install Kali Linux on your Android device. If this was helpful, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification. I will make other videos on how to use Kali Linux and lots of amazing things you can do with this piece of software. Now you just have to subscribe to this channel and then like the video. You can also join my discord server where we can communicate with each other and then find out what's going on. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.